Hello everyone, my name is Richard Evans over here at New Tech, and today I'm going to show you how to stream to Facebook using TriCaster's Standard Edition. Let's take a look. Now to start streaming, go ahead and open up the session. Alright, now that our session is loaded, I'm going to go ahead and loop this balloon clip in our DDR so we have something to stream to Facebook. Now click the gear icon next to stream, the top of your screen, and in the web browser provided, type in facebook.com. Now from here, click the drop down on the left and select the bottom option, which is create a connection from current URL. Now when it asks for connection type, select RTMP streaming and click OK. Now from here, go back to the left drop down and create a title for this preset. Under the streaming settings, select 1280 by 720 at 1280K. Then you'll notice under the URL bar, a button saying post to live now appears. Click this button. And once it loads, it will ask you to sign into Facebook. Make sure to put a check mark next to Keep Me Logged In to New Tech Share app. From here, you can select any page you manage under your Facebook login by selecting that page from the drop down next to Post to Live. Privacy settings can be changed on the Facebook website. Next to Title, you can enter in the title of your stream and a description in the description field. Once you are satisfied with your selections, press OK to close the streaming window. Now if you click the gear icon next to stream again, you'll see that both the address and stream ID have now been filled in by the Facebook streaming app. Press OK to close. Now click on the stream button itself. This button will light up as blue while your TriCaster makes the connection to your Facebook page. Once the connection is established, you'll see a clock appear and now you are streaming to Facebook. Now if you want to check on your stream, you'll have to go to another computer and open up a web browser and go to facebook.com and there you'll see your video. Now if you have any other problems logging in or just having problems in general, be sure to contact customer support at cs at newtech.com. Thank you very much. We'll see you next time.